Well, good morning, everyone. Happy Saturday. And an icy cold Saturday it is. Albert normally drops by early in the mornings to walk Cooper. And he's not being going to be able to make it this morning. Because the roads are so icy and they're snow covered right now. But it's ice underneath, which makes for really treacherous driving. Anyway, hope your Saturday's going well. Um, now today, I'll be showing you some more of my, uh, my online steals and deals and finds. In fact, let me start off with one right off the bat, and it's, it's so big, I can't fit the whole thing here on this camera. So, I took a picture, and you'll see in the picture here. This is a tapestry of the Zodiac I saw, and I just thought it was so cool. And I, I'm thinking about maybe putting it down to use as my um, reading cloth. But it's so big, I don't know how much of it will really um, be seen up here. So that remains to be seen, I guess. <laughs> and one more thing before I start reading. And I'm sure you all noticed it here in the background. It's a fiber optic light that I got. And it was only like a dollar or so online. And it was just, I don't know what I was thinking. But it adds some effect. Makes it all purdy like. And then after my reading, I have some more things I'll show you. I've been doing some rearranging here on my desk, as you can see, and starting to make way to try to put that tapestry down here. Like I said, I don't know if it'll fit. Just have to wait and see. But my, my skull was up over here in this corner, and this ball was down here, and just minor shuffling around. Speaking of shuffling, that's what I should be doing. Want to see some speed shuffling? Watch this. Impressed. <laughs> All right, so here's your card for today. What would it be? Ooh. You have the four of rods. Life is a party and you are the guest of honor. The four of rods points to a big joyous celebration that presents you with the opportunity to count your many blessings. This card can also foretell a wedding or committed partnership and indicates that establishing secure roots is of an extra importance to you. While it is fine to indulge in life's pleasures, you need to be aware of overindulgence because the party won't last forever and eventually you'll need to get back to work. Bring the happiness of this moment into the next stage, not the hangover. Keywords are celebration, joy, success, harmony, gifts, 
and marriage. Okay, in numerology, the Four of Wands is, of course, the number four. The element is fire. Astrological association is Venus and Aries. In the Tree of Life, the it's positioned in the sphere of love. And uh, Going Green Mom had uh, asked me to get into that further, which I will on my next reading. I'll try to remember. And uh, the key meanings are freedom, creativity, and domestic happiness. It's one of the happiest cards of the Tarot's Minor Arcana. The Four of Rods shows celebration. This lovely card reveals success. This lovely card reveals success after completion. A time for a reward. Socially, you will have the opportunity to celebrate and really enjoy yourself. The card predicts you will be brimming with confidence and full of vitality. You also establish yourself in your work and at home, completing a building or a remodeling project, or moving to a larger property. The vibe of the card is putting down roots, just like the rods. People around you note your willingness to be a pillar of the community and involve yourself in local issues and social events. In your work, your talent is appreciated and you are full of ideas and enthusiasm. Spiritually, the card shows you that you share your light with others. This often comes up in readings to predict that a new partner or love interest will open their hearts and express love and affection. It is also known as the honeymoon card, literally, or as a time to celebrate, run free, and enjoy what life has to offer. It is auspicious for creativity and artistic projects, flourishing under the uplifting influence of the Four of Rods. All right, so there you have it. Nice to have a really good reading. I love when that happens. Okay, now back to my finds. I managed to pick up this really cool set of steampunk sunglasses. They are so cool. They've got like springs over here and just little uh, little details. Very cool. Can't wait to have some sun so I can wear them. They are pretty dark, though. For future reference, I got a book. Monsters, Cryptids, and Mysterious Wild Beasts of West Virginia, Ohio, Maryland, and beyond. Just doing some research into the local uh, cryptid wildlife and hauntings. Next is... Oops, this pewter. And what it is, is a letter opener shaped as a sword. And it's being held by a dragon. It's pewter. Really cool. Was a little bit more than my other steals, but uh, I really wanted a letter opener, and I thought that was so cool. And for my next item, I really love this. Ah, you can't see it too much from down there. It is... Let me take it out of its base. Ah, the base is blinding. It is a... Let me find a good spot so you can really see the face. 
It is a dragon egg. And it's really cute. You can't see the face in here very well. But it's cute. It's got a little dragon down in there. And it lights up. To expose a little bugger down in there. And I got the blue one. That was my favorite color. But it's a baby dragon in an egg. And some things you just can't appreciate on film. You have to see it for yourself to really appreciate. And that's one of them. Well, I guess that covers enough of my uh, recent deals and deals. Um, I'm sure there'll be more coming in. And a few things will be going out to a few people. Anyway... That's all I have for today. So, hope you all are staying warm and out of this cold nastiness. Hope you're being careful on those roads because they are awful. At least right here, right now, where we're at, they are nasty. So, don't drive. Just, just don't. Don't do it. My spirit guides say, don't do it. So you better listen. <laughs> anyway, you all have a excellent Saturday. Blessed be. Peace. Believe because the spirits are out there. And until tomorrow, thanks for watching. Bye-bye.